hi guys welcome to another windows 10 tutorial today in this tutorial we'll learn how to connect a playstation 3 controller to windows 10 uh, you can connect either of the dualshock controller or the six axis controller in this uh, tutorial i'll be using a six axis controller as i don't have a dualshock controller with me so that's all right either of them works just fine the tool which i'll be using is scp you can find the download link to the tool in the description below so let's see how to configure that it's a fairly quick tutorial so let's get started apart from the tools which is in the description uh, you also need uh, .NET framework and the xbox driver but nothing to worry this already com comes pre-installed in windows 10 now connect your ps3 controller to your pc on through the usb port once you are connected open the downloaded uh, zip file extract the files from the downloaded zip file i will just extract it on my desktop you can extract it anywhere on your hard drive open the folder here you need to locate a file called scp driver make sure to run it as an administrator as we are installing drivers the administrator privileges are required click on the install button so this would start the installation as we can see all the drivers are getting installed in the install summary we see four applications and drivers are, that were installed okay click on exit now let us run on SCP monitor to see the status of the DS3 controller at this point your controller is ready and as you can see that's the mac address of the controller and the charging status of the controller so quickly let us quickly run a game and try to configure the controller well, one thing you need to remember here is it uh, internally the game assumes that uh, the game thinks that it is basically xbox controller so in your uh, controller selection list you need to select the xbox controller because the the driver which we the tool which we used actually installed the ps3 controller as an xbox controller right i'm using my keyboard right now go to helps and options click uh, controllers i'll hit enter to select the xbox controller now as you can see as the controller is selected i can use my controller to navigate so the controller is good to go now okay guys if you like this guide please hit that like button and uh, do subscribe to the channel thank you